All right, let's learn how to multiply fractions. It's really the easiest thing you can do with fractions. So what do we do? All we have to do is multiply the top two numbers, so 1 times 3, which is 3, and then divide by the bottom two, the, multiplying the bottom two numbers. So 4 times 5 is 20. And that's it. You multiply across the top, and then you multiply across the bottom. So if you can multiply numbers, you can multiply fractions. It's, it's just that easy. How about uh, 3 sevenths times 4 elevenths? Well, hopefully you've already done this in your head by the time I finish writing. 3 times 4, 12. 7 times 11, 77. And that's our answer. Easy as pie. Okay, what happens if we have just a single number times a fraction? So let's do like 5 times 2 over 17. So now we don't have a fraction. We have just a number times a fraction. Well, let me pull you aside for a second and just tell you that 5 is equal to 5 over 1. And if you remember what we talked about, that should make sense. This tells you how many pieces to cut the pie into. Well, if you only cut it into one piece, you haven't really cut it at all. It's just still one whole pie. And you have five of them. You have five whole things, so you just have the number five. You have five. Uh, one other way to look at this, in case you're still curious, is this is the same thing as 5 divided by 1, which you should know is simply 5. Okay, so you got that. So, so coming down here, if we wanted to, we could rewrite this as 5 over 1 times 2 over 17. And now we know how to do this. 5 times 2 is 10, and 1 times 7 is 17. So 5 times 2 is 10, 1 times 7 is 17. So we could write this intermediate step where we write 5 as 5 over 1. But I recommend that you don't even do that. You don't even, don't even waste the ink doing that unless it really helps you. Because we could easily just know that when we encounter a number times a fraction, what happened here? A number times a fraction, you just always multiply the number to the numerator for this reason. Okay, that's multiplying fractions. There's really nothing else to say. Uh, it, it's the simplest thing you can do with fractions. See you in the next video.